Championships from the beautiful city of Jeonju, Honam province of South Korea. I, it's my first time here, I have to say. It um, has been quite an experience. Korea in the autumn, a beautiful place. Temperatures, of course, around about 9, 10 degrees. Everyone here wrapped up. The players all ready to go. This is the men's single semi-final, match number 62. And it features one of two Chinese entrants. Tian Haowei playing in the yellow and orange against Lee Hyun Il of Korea. Warming up. That was Ken Hawaii's road to the final. The Japanese players of Riki Takashita and Akira Koga. 16 in 32 rounds, and then Malaysia's Zulkainen Zainuddin in the quarterfinals. One of the two games that he has dropped, only two games. And that's Hyun. Road hasn't dropped a set, hasn't dropped a game, sorry. Simon Santoso in the quarterfinals, Gong Hoon Kim in the round of 16, Wei Sheng Lo from Malaysia in the round of 32, and Chinese Taipei's Xiao Sin Wan in the round of 64. So three different, four different nationalities, four different styles is played. And now, the daddy of it all. Ready to play. Let's take on a Chinese player. To reach the final of the men's singles here at the John Victor Career Grand Prix Gold. Seed, Tian Haowei, ranked 65 in the world. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Lee Yong Yi, Korea. And on my left, Tian Haowei, China. DOE to serve. Lobo, play. Service over. One, love. That one too long. Service over. One off. Service over. Two, one.
so far. Stretching well there. Respected veteran, Lee Hunil, 33 years old now. And that one not five. Over there, but a distinguished two. career for Lee Hunil. Bronze medalist of the World Championships in 06, and five Asian Championships, and of course the gold at the Sudirman Cup in 2003. So, no stranger to the big games, and now in the twilight. And again, finding trouble Six, net on that left side, two. giving away points. Now, Yanil, a national hero, of course, he retired in 2008. He was persuaded to come back in 2010, which he did because there was a void of six players in the team career squad. And he participated in the 2010 Thomas Cup, playing in two singles matches. He lost the Chen Long in the Summer Olympics. of memories he's already had in his distinguished career and now he's facing the might of the Chinese game 8-3 how it's playing out so far as the auditorium begins to fill out four eight four back here More of a question of Tian Hao Wei may be taking his foot off the pedal. of the game Nine, lifting a little there. Nine five, five now. Ten highway. Ten five. 
So far, no way in. No way to break the defenses of this man. And so the 11 point break, no surprises to Tian Wei after dominating that first period. He is up with a commanding six point lead. And the veteran, Li Yun Il, has been doing his best. But has really. Seven. I could say that the Uno would come back with a little bit more power. He's been relying more on the length of his opponent's shots. Now a little bit more attacking. Service so that wealth of experience seven. he's got. Hand. That's why very hard to control. And ten how weight. Serve again. Service over. Eight. Twelve. He lost that rather tamely. Kind of shot we'd expect from the Legion. Involved. Beautiful jump drive, cross court. <laughs> Just out of reach. Shot to make. I didn't quite clear it. After a beautiful little lift from mid court. Is it enough though?
Well, for one point ten four up was this way. This is what experience is all about. So, Tian Ha Wei has his three point lead reinstalled. Just a few millimeters, in fact, it wasn't even a foot. Close enough to the net. Lost a bit of power over the last few years, but the accuracy was there. going to be. Aimed straight for him. of the game. Hyun in the lead.
clear. Right. Ah. So she wasn't ready for that trade of net drops. Seven the angled one as well, so we reach the business end of this game. What looked to be a very easy finishing run by the Chinese players. Now we're going to be a tricky game of cat and mouse. Nineteen seventeen, and if you've just joined us, this probably not representative of how this game has gone with the Chinese player here, Tian Hao Wei, at one point being ten five up. Just called out. Eighteen. Nineteen. <laughs> Which gives Tian Hawei a lead in. That's quite a way out as well. Championships. It took him a little bit of time to warm up in this. I'm sure he was a bit worried earlier on in the game, but totally in control of this point. As you can see, Tian Haowei is almost run out of energy at the end of it by just being moved around.
so game point. Game one of the men's singles semi-finals, 21-18. It's the first score to come off it. And Lee Hyun Il, who has been to a number of big name tournaments, is now in the lead here after taking a little while to warm up, safe to say. That was one of them. Misjudged shot. See, helped along by the net at times. This the 15th and final event, of course, in the BWF Grand Prix Gold and Grand Prix Calendar, the John Ju Victor Korea Grand Prix Gold. And it's a season that has started off in March. Germany, went to Switzerland, Australia, New Zealand, the Malaysia Open, and it was Thailand, the US, Canada, China, Indonesia, Russia, London, Dutch, the Holland Open, and then Call one, 20 seconds. Korea now. Call one, 20 seconds. A lot of winners, and Tan Hao Wei, of course, the winner in Australia and in London. But a game down here to Lee Hyunil, which will be his first win should he make it to the final tomorrow and go through. point there. it a little bit easier in this second game but if Lee Hyun Il can hold on this will of course be his second men's singles title after winning in 2011 so far doing well Service 
right. I'm gonna have two Three, titles this year ready. Two. He's not gonna be giving up without a fight. Taking a commanding lead in the second game as he has to. 5 2 now. But to say that, he did take a commanding lead in the first game. Lost that one out. Ball. Just clip the net. And it's uh, as well known. Five now. much for 10 away. Again, just level pegging. Six, seven.
seven or everything to play for. made to possibly wipe down the court Let's take a little bit of a break just so you know highly taped up knee Which on the man, of course 33 years old still competing for retiring ones Different story for him. safe rally but then you nil tried to go for the killer shot it was long and with that he may have just given Tian Hao Wei an extra edge Another victim. back to service. Just a slight drop in play. You can see here. Service over. Net to nine. Eleven, again. Eleven eight. eight. And at the midpoint. A different second game for sure. Some of the highlights. Come, of course, today after this, the women's double semi final. The Singaporean pair of Sari Shinta Mulia and Yao Lei against the Korean second seeded Ko Ah and Yu Hei. Then there's another China Korea battle in the women's singles He Bing Zhao versus Bei Yun Ju. And to round off the day, the men's doubles semi final 
of Kim Ki Jung and Kim Sa Rang versus Han Tao Sung and Kim Duk Jung. Eleven, eight. All Korean eight. men's doubles final guaranteed. That's all coming up in his run right now. Men's singles semi finals. Still keeping pace with the Chinese player, 10 12. That one just out. Tian Hui took a swing at it, hit the net, and now the deficit is just one point. And it's looking alarmingly like what happened in the first game with this strategy that Hyun Il has of coming back in the second part of the game. Again there. 12 all out. the right place. Now he is again facing a deficit at the wrong time. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fourteen. Leave it that high. And he's played that thousands of times. Oh. 
Place it. So 16 15. We get closer to the business end. The psychology of it is that Lee Hyanil knows he's just five points away from a place in the final, whereas Tian Awe has another game to play. this up, reclaim his title that he won in 2011. That. 16. Oh. It's going to come down to the wire. Seventeen, sixteen. now, just edging closer 17, to another 16. spot in another final. Long and illustrious career. Moving forward closer to the net. 18, 16. Can he just hold on for three more points? The effort he put into that jump. Again, proving that if you leave an experienced player with that much height, he will know exactly where to smash it. It's been a good performance from Tian Hao Wei. 1916. Good work to do.
best badminton at these last match points. Point. Match point. to wait a little bit longer. 17, 20. Could have been. Congratulations to Lee Hyun Il. Be back with another semi final in just a second. Match one by Lee Hyun Il. 21, 18, 21, 17. 